Hello and welcome to today's devotion. My name is Toba and with my wife Abimbala, we are the African Connect Pastors for Audacious Church. This week, we are on a journey through Matthew 28, 16 to 20, the Great Commission, a moment in history where Jesus equipped, empowered, and enabled his followers to change the world. <laughs> we have looked at the power of obedience, the call to make disciples, the authority of Christ, and baptism as a sign of discipleship. Today, as we finish the journey, let's look at the presence of Christ with us. <laughs> One of the most comforting promises in the scripture comes at the end of Matthew 28, 20. And surely I am with you always to the very end of the age. Jesus assures his disciples that even as he sends them out into the world to make disciples, he will not leave them alone. His presence is with them, guiding and sustaining them. The promise isn't just for the original disciples. It's for all who follow Christ. No matter where we go or what challenge we face, Jesus is with us. Us. His presence brings peace in times of uncertainty, strength in times of weakness, and comfort in times of trial. As we seek to fulfill the great commission in our lives, we can take heart knowing that we are not not doing this work uh, by ourselves. Jesus is with us every step of the way, empowering us to share the gospel, make disciples, and live out our faith. The promise of Christ's presence always reminds us of his faithfulness. He is not a distant God, but a personal Savior who works with us through every season of life. <laughs> Whether we are on the mountain top or we are in the valley, Jesus is there. His presence is a source of hope and encouragement, giving us the confidence to face whatever comes our way as we go about our daily lives. Let's remain aware of his presence with us when we feel overwhelmed or inadequate. We can draw strength from the fact that we are never alone. <laughs> Christ is always by our side, equipping us for the mission he has called us to. Hallelujah. Let us pray together. Jesus, thank you for the promise, promise of your presence. Help us to trust in your nearness and draw strength from knowing that you are always with 
be always with us. Guide us as we seek to follow your call and make disciples. And the people of God will say, Amen. Love you, church, and thank you for joining me this week on our journey through Matthew 28, 16 to 20, the Great Commission. God bless you.